Hi, Richie here, the Garden Project Sacro, up in the greenhouse. We're trying to overwinter a couple of herbaceous perennial plants to be planted out in the border down by the mansion house at Tullcross Park next spring. So what's important at this time of year, if you're trying to overwinter things in an unheated greenhouse, is to not water things when it's going to be freezing. Obviously recently there's been a lot of very cold weather, but there's going to be a few days now when there's no zero below zero degrees forecast. So I'm going to give a little drop of water to a few things that look dry. It's really important not to overwater things in the winter. You don't want these pots turning into solid ice. You can see these white little lumps. That's perlite. I've added that 50-50 to the plants that we potted up ourselves. That's going to give really good drainage and stop the compost from becoming a block of ice. There's some things, like these rows of Sharon, that we bought in, potted up, and they came in in pure peat. So I want to be very careful when watering these, not to overwater them, not to water them when we have freezing temperatures forecast. So most of the plants that we're trying to overwinter here are for the herbaceous borders at the mansion house. We have white agapanthus called polar ice. Rose of Sharon, which isn't herbaceous perennial, is a shrub. We have blue aquilegia. And queen of the ocean, blue agapanthus. We also sowed seeds for delphinium, both a blue and a white type. Hopefully these will overwinter okay. They sprouted right in the middle of winter. They seem to be doing okay. But if it does get cold and wipe them out, we still have more seeds that we can sow again in spring. We have pink aquilegia. Aquilegia black barlow. And at the end there, agapanthus twister, which is a nice mix of blue and white. So in conclusion, if you want to overwinter your plants in an unheated greenhouse, first of all, make sure you have really good drainage with 50-50 compost to perlite mix. Make sure you don't overwater your plants and especially don't water them in sub-zero temperatures. Make sure your plants don't touch against each other as diseases will build up here where the leaves touch each other. And lastly, every now and then, when it's not freezing, open the doors and the windows, let the air pass through. This will also stop diseases from building up. Thanks for joining me. Take care. Bye-bye.